In this video, we want to show you how to build your own Hacker air quality sensor. You can use it to learn about air quality where you live, and with lots and lots of them connected across Europe, we can build a better map of the air that we breathe. In this video, we will build the Hacker home sensor that you can connect to your home network. You can also build a Hacker mobile sensor that you can use when you're out and about. So let's assemble the sensor. We'll need the following materials. An Arduino microcontroller, the assembled Wi-Fi shield and an air quality sensor. We are using the Nova PM SDS011. You can buy the Wi-Fi shield readily assembled from Innova Fubs or build it yourself from the individual components. There's a tutorial for that. You'll also need a power supply, a USB cable, a computer and a screwdriver. To begin, we need to put the shield on top of the Arduino. Stack them carefully and make sure you don't bend any of the pins. The pins fit one by one. Make sure it's a tight fit. Now we need to attach the sensors. Each sensor wire is labelled on top and you also find labels on top of the shield. Let's first connect the data wires. The first one is labelled TXD on the sensor. We connect it to the RX pin on the Wi-Fi shield. Unscrew the screw terminal, insert the wire and screw it tight. The connection should be firm now. The next wire is labelled RXD on the sensor. We connect it to TX on the shield. Unscrew, insert and screw tight. And again, test the connection. Now we move on to the power wires. The last one with the stripes is the 5 volt wire. We'll connect it to the 5 volt pin. Insert it and screw tight. The last cable is the ground cable. Connect it to ground. When all the connections are tight, we're done. To install the software on the sensor, grab your computer and connect it to the Arduino using a USB cable. You will need to download the Arduino software. You'll find links in the tutorial. And we also need the HackAir home libraries from GitHub. You will also need to log in to your user account on HackAir and create a new sensor. We will need the access key when installing the software. Once your downloads are complete, install the Arduino software and open it. Now include the zip file library that you just downloaded and open the Wi-Fi shield sketch. For that, go to Files, Examples, HackAir. Check the sensor ID and add your access key here. Save the file and click the upload button to install the software on your Arduino. Success! Now grab your mobile phone to connect the sensor to your Wi-Fi. Follow the instructions there. Once your sensor is online, you can go to your profile and look at your sensor and you will see measurements from your sensor come in. And that's basically it. Build a nice case and hang the sensor outside. Over time, you will see how air quality varies with the weather, with traffic and other conditions. And once there are enough sensors in your neighborhood, you can easily pinpoint hotspots and work with others to reduce air pollution. You can find the full, full list of sensors on our website, hackair.eu, and you'll also find lots of other information to improve air quality.